Hey everyone, welcome to the Crypto ZX channel. Happy Friday wherever you are around the world. I hope you all have a great relaxing weekend ahead of you. You know, I took two days off. You know, I was unable to make any updates for you guys over the past few days, but you know, I just needed a break, guys. You know, once in a while you do need a break. I've been grinding out videos for you guys since this year has started. So, you know, a little bit of a break in between is very much needed. So, I uh, just wanted to let you guys know that. Uh, but now let's get right in today's markets and see what is happening with the markets and where uh, we potentially could be going as we are approaching the weekend as and also a new month you know it's absolutely mind-boggling uh to think that you know the month of march has gone by and it honestly feels like yesterday when this month has started but if we're looking across the markets you guys can see over the last 24 hours we're seeing a lot of altcoins in green right now and the main reason as to why that's the case is because bitcoin is trying to break out of that massive level of resistance so we're going to discuss that as well but as you guys know by the title of the video that we are going to be talking about v chain all right my v chain family first and foremost thank you so much for all the support love your support on a continuous basis continue liking commenting and subscribing and i'll bring you guys these updates but before we jump into the charts guys can we talk about this new logo update that has happened on coin market cap and on coin gecko i'm absolutely loving this we're used to seeing the blue logo for the longest time and honestly i love that logo it's just uh, you know an og logo but you know we're seeing a little bit of a change a little bit of a new look and i really really do like this kind of it gives it um i don't know like a futuristic uh type of look um let me know if you guys agree with that because no more circle and i, and I just wanted to point that out for you guys but now if we're looking at the price the price is currently trading at 0 0.0235 cents we're up 2.9 percent in the last 24 hours in usd comparative we're also up 1.5 percent in bitcoin comparative over the last 24 hours this is what i want you guys to keep in mind you know bitcoin is still on an upwards trend BTC dominance is on an upward spike, but we're seeing VeChain up in Bitcoin comparative. So what that basically means is we are outperforming Bitcoin right now. If we're looking at the market cap, the market cap is currently sitting at $1.7 billion and the 24 hour trading volume currently sitting at $67 million. But now let's focus on the price and see what is happening and where we could be going in the immediate short term. But before we jump into that, you guys know the jazz by now. Just a disclaimer, anything on this channel is not financial advice. Always do your own due diligence and research when you are investing in crypto. So if we're looking at the bigger time frame, guys, you know the bigger picture we're still nowhere close to the price movements that we have seen over the past you know cycle you know we saw tremendous amount of growth and look where it all started you know this is what i continue telling each and every one of you guys right now the importance why is a lot of other altcoins breaking out right now and vchain has yet to break out you know we've been retesting the zone now you may be coming out and saying crypto zx you've been talking about this level for the longest time now but you know vchain just doesn't want to budge uh, and and that level that I'm talking about is at that 3.4 cents a mark. You know, we've been trying tremendously uh, to break out of this zone, but every single time, guys, it's still seeing a rejection. But what did I project? You know, I do believe altcoin season is near. And look what happened. Look how important this level of resistance really was for the price of VeChain when it was breaking out. Obviously, we can make the statement that, you know, we were hitting uh, all-time highs at that point. So, you know, their uh, price discovery was... Um, you know in play so you know when price discovery there's no levels of resistance and support uh, price can move up very quickly depending on the overall buying pressure so yes definitely that could be one case that could be made but this shows us the importance of that zone we've been trying to break out here but i do believe altcoin season is very near we're seeing bitcoin guys trading sideways over the past now you know since since March 17, we've been consolidating within the 61.8 Fibonacci retracement level. We did see today, this morning, VeChain break. I'm sorry, Bitcoin break out of this level of resistance and actually was unable to close above here. But maybe after this upload, we are above this, and this could mean Bitcoin is going to pump even higher, in my personal opinion. And look at Bitcoin dominance, hasn't even budged, hasn't even budged at all. So, um, you know, considering these factors, you know, we're seeing VeChain up in Bitcoin dominance, which is a definitely a good thing to point out for you guys. And if Bitcoin were to break out towards the upside, I do think, you know, um, VeChain is also going to break out of this massive level of resistance it's facing right now. And we could potentially be 
starting to form a breakout pattern especially above this 3.4 cents mark guys this would mean that the consolidation phase the bear cycle has gone behind us and you know we are headed towards the upside I've always told you guys, you know, what VeChain is doing, it is here to compete with the other blockchain projects. A lot of negative tone still within the community. Obviously, when the prices are doing great, you know, the negative tone kind of calms down. But, you know, when the prices are kind of boring, you know, we see tons of these comments flowing in. Oh, VeChain is dead, going absolutely nowhere. And yet these people are still watching my videos. Um, so, you know, they still like VeChain. Oh, and that's not a secret at this point. But, you know, I really do believe, you know, our time is coming, guys. You know, patience is your best friend. You know, I know a lot of new money is coming into the markets. The one thing that I can tell you guys is patience is your number one key to follow. If you have patience, if you have done your due diligence and research and have invested where you can afford to lose patience is your number one key and that will reward you at the end of the day. So this is my current scenario on VeChain. I do expect all coin season is very near, but this is currently the scenario. We're still facing quite a bit of resistance around here. Uh, if we get a little bit of more volume and Bitcoin were to have a breakout, I do expect that VeChain is going to break out of this consolidation phase. So good things definitely ahead. Let me know down below what you guys think, uh, where you could see the price of VeChain going at the end of this year. And do not forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Love you all. See you tomorrow. I've been CryptoZX and peace out.